Hello once again YouTube, this is Pilsy74 bringing you another game of Assassin's Creed Revelations in my 24th video, plus a few on Temple Hub and some other stuff. I'm finally bringing you my least favorite game mode, Artifact Assault. I just, I don't know what it is, don't like the game mode, but before I go any further, I'm gonna get roofed through a tunnel. Gotta love lag. Anyway, Artifact Assault is essentially capture the flag. There is a line running down the middle of the map. And if you're on your flag side, you are a pursuer. If you're on the other side, you are a target. And the problem that I have with this game mode, and not necessarily this map actually, Galata I have to say is actually pretty good for this. Um, there are a lot of people that will play this game mode, especially in maps like Venice or Rome, and stand at the border and um, just, you know, throw smoke and go stun and then run back. And it's really annoying. You scored. So, I, I just, I, I can't stand it. You know, you're trying to do something, you know, the point of the game is to steal the artifact, like I'm about to do. You stole the enemy's artifact. And not to just, you know, stun people. But here I go, I use my teleport, which is uh, something I just used in this game mode. Completely go in the wrong corner of the map. You know, we're meant to go diagonally across, not just across, across. But, I'm on my side, I'm going to uh, go back to my base, which is down here. And over here, I'm going to run on the roof and stay on the roof. I've been killed way too many times jumping off the roof and, you know, having someone there. A decent strategy here is to plant someone close by. I mean, even if... Uh, you know, well, flying in isn't going to work. But if you plant someone close by, the thing is, look at my compass right now. I'm close to my artifact. My compass isn't showing me anything. Obviously, the, the thing in the upper right is. And now someone's in my line of sight, and I thought it was him, and it wasn't, but lost that contract. And hey, look, here's someone running right at me. So I think I'll kill him. And hey, look, here's his teammate running right at me. So I think I'll kill him. And hey, look, there's another guy who is in a crowd and I can't get a lock on and runs away and I get an NPC and he stuns me. Um, but a lot of times what you can do is you can plant someone or, or stay by the other team's artifact, especially while someone on your team is stealing the artifact. And number one, that will make it so once their artifact resets, either by your teammate getting the artifact like here, or you know, me failing at a corner stun. But if I got there and I got into a blend group, if my teammate was killed, or when my teammate reached our base, uh, I would stun the artifact immediately. So there's my teammate. We just scored. scored. So I'm going to go up and try to get the artifact again, because that is just what I do in this mode. I prefer, much prefer playing offense. Uh, there are a few decent areas to go. I saw you, so I think I'll stun you. There are a few decent ways to go here, and the way I was going the previous two rounds, the uh, previous two times I came up here, is one I like, which is right to the right there. There's a little, little ledge that you can go on. So I'm going to do here, I stole the artifact, I'm going to hit a chase breaker, and I'm going to use my teleport and get someone closer to the end. Notice that the teleport, I didn't even get halfway across the map. I didn't get to the, um, to the border. Or, yeah, I didn't get to the borderline, which is kind of weird. If I use my teleport to get an escape, and luckily my teammate, I uh, killed that guy. I mean, I, I was knifed, but I think I had gotten the um, artifact before that. So here's something interesting. My, one of my teammates, whoever's playing defense here, there's something about this. Um, you'll notice that there is, right when I'm walking, there is a tripwire bot. The thing is, to do, to steal the artifact, you only have to step one foot inside this huge circle. And not, and it doesn't really much matter, um, where. So you can step, and, and just like I just did, you step in the edge of the circle, you steal the artifact, and you can leave. And so putting a tripwire bomb on any part of the um, any part of the circle that's not an out, that's not on the outside part of it 
It's really kind of useless. And here I saw this guy. Luckily it wasn't too late. So I'm going to stun him. And my teleport's back. Uh, except that I just got roofed. So basically my strategy mostly here is just to, you know, run at the artifact, steal it. If I have to use my smoke, I use my smoke. And then go through Chase Breaker and teleport the hell out of there. Because that's going to be the easiest way for me to get back. Now a lot of times what happens, especially in the bigger maps, especially in the newer maps I should say, is that the teleport, you don't get... Oops. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, he just me. You don't get halfway across the map. And so the problem that happens is that a lot of times you will teleport right to where those people are hugging the border and they'll immediately kill you, which really kind of sucks. You know, it's like, okay, well, what the hell's the point if I'm, you know, if I'm just going to be... Thank you. You know, what's the point of using teleport if I'm just going to be, um, you know, be put right where my enemies are? Yeah, that's good, though. Taunt when I'm on top of you. Now, you'll notice um, my uh, challenge came up. My, uh, so, I'm actually changing my purpose here. Um, my purpose, I've now changed to um, challenges. And I'm going to try to do all the challenges. Um, there's my extreme variety. And some of them I have a long way to go. Um, I think I need, at this point, 196 uh, multi-kills in Manhunt to get the last part of that challenge. But that's what I'm going to do from now on, is really go for the challenges. So I'm still going to play a variety of game modes. I still... Almost every game mode, there's a challenge that I have to complete. Um, whether it's getting a five silent streak and wanted, whether it's being uncorrupted at the end of a match. Um, I did complete the ones for Artifact Assault. The only one thing I really didn't do and is um, use Teleport to escape, which I do here, I believe, maybe not. But you can use tele if you use teleport to escape, that's one of the challenges. Now the trick to this is that if you're using teleport to escape, you um you actually have to use you have to escape before you put oh there you go. So you have to escape before you actually get the artifact back because the second one didn't count. The first one counted because I had the escape the chase meter had run out before I um, I had hit the I had returned the artifact I scored with the artifact but the second one didn't count which is really just you know it makes it a little bit harder. This is the only mode I use teleport just like escort's the only mode really that I use the gun and those challenges aren't going to be easy either because you have to the challenge with the gun is you have to uh, have three kills with the gun. And I don't use the gun three times in a match, so uh, this is you know it's it's not going to be an easy thing for me to do. But uh, back to the match here. For some reason, I'm still up on the roof here. I'm you know I keep seeing them come over. We're up six to two. So I decided you know what, screw it. I'm going to go for the artifact again. We're up six to two. My teleport. I was waiting for my teleport to come back, and now it's back. So I'm just going to run in, and it's just kind of surprising that no one is guarding this thing. Because usually there's at least one person... Oops. I spoke too soon. There's usually at least one person around the artifact. Um, in this case, I guess the guy was running back. I don't know. Maybe he had just spawned in. Maybe... I, I really don't know, but he caught me on the way down. If I'd gone to the chase breaker, I don't know if he would have caught me. But there's 33 seconds left. I decided, you know what? My uh, teammate has the artifact. The enemy's artifact is back. And he just lost it. The but there's no real point in me back. going for the artifact anymore simply because I'm not going to be able to get back there and back in 20 seconds, even with the teleport. So there's the one of the targets. Of course, the multi kill bonus in this doesn't count towards the uh, challenge. And that's really the game. So I realized I didn't talk much about the artifact assault, but, you know. You now know what I'm going to be doing, what the, fo the focus is, foci, foci, I don't even know, of my future um, 
videos would be. And that's it. So as always, I will show my scores. I'm also gonna start showing my progress and challenges. Um, because after all, again, this is the point of these videos now. It's the point of playing the game now for me. Uh, if I have the commentary, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.